too often on News 12 New Jersey, we seem to be reporting on incidents regarding misbehaving parents and fans at youth sports events. In Branchburg this summer, a 72-year-old umpire had his jaw broken by a parent coach who has been charged with assault. News 12's Brian Donahue reports on an incident at youth football game last weekend that had league officials considering allowing referees to literally throw the penalty flag on fans. Just when we've hit rock bottom, we find a new trap door. That's a description of parent and fan behavior at youth football games. Sent in a letter to parents from Frank Sinatra Jr., the president of the Freehold Revolution. They compete in the New Jersey American Youth Football Organization. Sinatra sent that letter last week after two referees quit after a New Jersey AYF game between what one parent said was a team from Sparta and a team from Elizabeth. The letter says four officials had to leave the field under police escort after being verbally abused by angry parents and fans, including an incident that occurred in the restroom. The Freehold Revolution plays in the same league as those two teams. Players competing are between the ages of 5 and 14. And Sinatra says he sent the letter simply to reiterate to Freehold parents that there would be zero tolerance of such behavior here. Now, the letter from Sinatra warned of a new AYF policy in which a referee or official seated in that booth up there in the stands could actually throw a penalty flag for unruly fan behavior and penalize the team 15 yards. Kevin Hester, president of the New Jersey AYF, said that was a proposal that was on the agenda of a recent board meeting, but it was not passed. So it appears for now, at least, the kids on the field won't have to pay the price for the behavior of their parents and fans in the stands. Sinatra's letter also reminds people that four games being played this Sunday here will take place on the anniversary of the September 11th, 2001 terrorist attacks, a day which, if you can't keep it under control any other day of the year, should remind us all what's really important. In Freehold, Brian Donahue, News 12, New Jersey. AYF officials had no comment on the incident with the referees last week. News 12 also reached out to both teams in that game and did not get a response.